Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David and this is a deck review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for being here. I got a haircut. That's right. <laughs> that was the first thing you thought, right? Like, oh my gosh, you got a haircut. Hey, it's COVID season. Like I don't get to the barbershop as often as I'd like. So uh, yeah, it's Monday. <laughs> Let's talk about something that's actually important. It is Monday. It's Monday and that's the day that I reserve to do a deck review because that's how this channel started. And I'm always going to go back to my roots. And the whole thing just started off with me just having a little camera on a tripod on a table in the fellowship center of my church where I go to church and just going through my deck collection, showing people my cards and saying, hey, you know, I, this is something that I do. I collect playing cards and I just wanted to raise awareness about that. I like talking about playing cards. I like talking about the art. I like talking about the inspiration behind them. And so it, it's just been a part of my life uh, as, for as long as I can remember. I just collect decks of cards. People have asked, well, how many decks do you have in your collection? I have like close to 2000, somewhere in there. So it's not a huge, 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 huge collection, but uh, I like it, it's mine. And if you like playing cards, if you enjoy these videos, do me a favor, hit like, hit subscribe, hit those notification buttons, pook, 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 so that you can be alerted the next time a review goes live. Today we're looking at the Slow Hands deck. This is the second edition. These are the tortoise backs. These are from Nick Nisko and Kier Gomes. Kier Gomes actually has his own YouTube channel, if you're not aware, where he does playing card reviews all the time. In fact, you should just stop watching this and go watch Nick's video if you haven't done so already. It's his deck. He's a way better cinematographer than I am. <laughs> He's way hipper than I am and younger than I am. Uh, he takes way better pictures. That's cinematographer. That's the same thing, David. And he's going to be way more excited about his own deck. So I would just stop watching me and just go over and watch him. All right, you're still here. The tuck case is all done in a turquoise. It's very deep color. It says slow hands, playing cards up at the top. And then in the corner, you have a hand underneath a turtle shell. And this is the V2 symbol. If you remember the V1 symbol was a hand making a P symbol underneath a snail shell. So two slow uh, animals, two slow objects, right? With a hand uh, underneath. One side says tortoise backs, the other side says Gomes and Nisco. The bottom has some ad copy about the Slow Hands edition. The top is just the Slow Hands playing card logo. The back design, of course, is the back design of the cards. And the large tuck flap says slow, steady, natural. That's everything I can say about the tuck case. Let's break it open and look inside. Look at that gorgeous back design. Tortoise backs, as you can see, it looks like a tortoise shell, right? It looks like a tortoise shell. You have a medium poker border. It says slow hands on top and bottom. As far as I can tell, it's a two-way back design, but if you see something different, let me know. With this deck, you're going to get two original jokers. Up in the corner, it says SH for slow hands, right? Slow hands. It's kind of a homage to the bicycle symbol that's in the corner of their jokers. It says joker at the top. Then you get a kind of a 12-inch or a 16-inch bicycle that has training wheels on it, which is kind of like a step up from the tricycle they had before. Riding the bike, there is a tortoise and it is below a sewer grate. One joker has a two of spades reveal that's popping out of the grate. And both jokers together would be great for sandwich effects and three card money. Also with this deck, you're gonna get a duplicate two of spades, which is great for card to impossible location effects. And you'll also get a blank faced card, which is great for magic tricks. Your ace of spades is a nice, thick, fat, chunky spade with a heavy base. It's got that slow hands V2 figure crawling away from the spade. It says slow hands, gums and nisco, tortoise backs underneath. Your pips and indices, your blacks are black and your reds aren't exactly red. They're a darker, more deeper shade of orange, but I like that. You can, I mean, in a regular, you know, a non deck collector, non magician probably won't even notice it. It's gonna fly right by them, but uh, your keen eye will notice it. Your court cards are also going to be industry standard. They have been recolored, though, to match the theme of the deck. Your two custom courts are going to be your kings. Uh, your king of hearts is Nick Nisko, who is the designer, graphic designer of this deck. And your king of clubs is Kier Gomes, who is, you know, the producer of this deck. Uh, his card, of course, you might recognize from the... Black Roses decks, Daniel Schneider did the art on this. That's just what the cards look like. You also wanna know how they feel and how they handle. What I can do 
is I can put 10 cards in the caliper, measure them, and compare them against other decks that I own. 10 cards in the caliper come to 2.84. 2.84 is thick. It is a thicker card than your regular off-the-shelf bike. So these would be more of what we would say is a casino deck, more crispy, right? And that also means that you're gonna be able to put these through the ringer, they'll last you a good long time. All right, where do you pick these cards up? Where do you get them from? I think they're 12 bucks a piece. You can find them at elementalplayingcards.com. That is the only place you can find them, elementalplayingcards.com. I would also recommend that you follow Kier Gomes, follow him on YouTube, follow him on Instagram, follow Slow Hands on Instagram as well. I'll put some of those links below and in this video frame. Big huge shout out to Kier Gomes. You're killing it, brother, you're killing it. And I wanna thank him for sending me this deck so that I could do the review for you. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.